Hello ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? It is your host, the one at only one head is. And today guys, I'm bringing you a TDM gameplay here on the map Biolab using the AK-12 royalty. Very, very excited to be bringing you guys this gameplay here today. This weapon is pretty decent. Um, actually, you guys see the stats of it on screen now. I take that back. It's not a very good royalty weapon at all. It's the same as the AK-12 finger trap, which is, if you guys are familiar with it, is not a very good royalty weapon or elite variant at all. So... Oh, just got a cheeky kill there, man. Nice. All right. So you guys see the uh, stats of it on screen now. Obviously, just showed it to you. Uh, it has a plus three in handling, though. So a lot of you guys may be thinking, Hennis, what are you talking about? It has a plus three in handling, and it doesn't seem to have any decreases to it uh, as far as the stats go. So how can you be calling this a bad weapon? Well, let me answer that question to you guys. If you look very closely, you will actually notice that you are not allowed to put any attachments on this weapon whatsoever, which makes it very, very difficult for someone like me who's used to using uh, SMGs and, you know, having to be able to move fast while aiming down the sights. Um, obviously, you can't put stock in this weapon, you can't put quick draw, you can't put extended mags, you can't put any of that good stuff on this gun because it's just not allowed. So, yeah, unfortunately, we can't do that. Um, but what we can do is have a plus three in handling. Now, when I first saw this weapon, I thought to myself, all right, so this weapon has a plus three in handling, doesn't allow you to put attachments on it. I'm not really too sure what handling is, but whatever it is, it must be the greatest thing in the world if you're not allowed to put any uh, attachments on this weapon as a result of it. So I checked, and it turns out that handling actually does nothing good for me whatsoever from what I can tell. You guys will have to literally tell me what handling does down in the comment section below because I literally have absolutely no idea what handling does for assault rifles. Like, I literally could not tell you why this weapon is supposed to be an elite variant. It just does not make sense to me. So you guys will have to tell me down in the comment section below because I am just, I, I'm lost. I'm 100% lost right now as to why this is an elite variant. Okay, make that explode. Come on, man. We actually just let that guy get away. All right, man, we're going to get this kid. Oh, no. Hey, there we go. We can pick him off. Nice work, teammates. Teammates were there to help my booty right there. So we actually got to make sure that we play pretty passive and pretty smart with this weapon because I've tried to get this DNA bomb so many times with this gun and it just it just has not worked out for me just because this gun is just not good at all. It's just not a good weapon. So we're going to have to make sure that we play smart, play passive, and most of all, play smart, like I already said. Because this weapon, it just, it just doesn't allow you to rush up like I'm used to doing with a lot of uh, other good weapons. Like with the uh, ASM1 Magnitude, you can rush. Uh, with some other, you know, good weapons, you can rush. You know, maybe with a Bal Obsidian Steed, you could rush a little bit because it has that increase in damage. But it just, it really doesn't allow you to play like I usually, it doesn't allow people to play like they usually would uh, when you're using this weapon. See, as you guys can see in this gameplay, I'm playing very, very passive right now. And that's just because it's just not a good weapon to use. I'm just not good with it. Oh man, dude, that guy had shots on us before we could even understand what was happening. So I don't really like to hang around these canisters a lot of the time. I pass through there pretty quickly, obviously for reasons, because if you run into a smart player who's going to acknowledge that, he's just going to pick you right off. Oh, thank God we were actually able to get that guy. I was actually getting pretty nervous right there. Let's check those windows right there. Regain our health a little bit. I'm not sure where this guy is, man. Where is this guy, bro? Oh, this guy's coming in. Oh, he's in. He made it in. Oh, can we hit fire him? Yeah, we can. All right, nice. Let's call in our UAV. Now we can actually see where these guys are at. And I don't know if they're going to be rushing me in here. Okay, good. It doesn't look like it. Because the last thing I want right now is for people to be rushing me like madmen. Is there a dude in here? Okay, I could have swore I saw a dude in the corner right there. All right, let's back up here a little bit. Back up, back up, back up, teammate. Don't corner. No! Oh, my God. That was close. That was too close for comfort, man. Too close for comfort. Now that enemy's over there as well. Let's jump up here. Oh, shoot. Where was I just getting shot from? Let's explode that over there. Reload this. It looks like a lot of them are actually, judging by the minimap, doesn't look like many are over here. Because my, my teammates have had that area locked down. So I'm actually just going to patrol this area over here. All right, did my teammate... My teammate got killed, man. All right, so that's not too great. But we were able to get him, though. My teammate was able to take a bullet for me. We knew where that guy was. And we were able to get him. So that guy could have pushed out there, man. Last thing I really want right now is to get sniped, but I feel like that's how I'm going to go. Like, if I'm going to die using this weapon, it's just, it's, it's, it's going to happen because, because I get sniped. Like, that's, that's just how it's going to work. Shoot, man, I couldn't get that guy. And I need, I need kills badly right now. Nice. Able to get that guy. These guys are going to find out pretty soon here that I'm, like, camping as well. I'm not really camping, though. I think it's unfair to say that I'm camping. 
I think it is 100% fair to say, though, that I am playing very, very passively right now. Alright, we need ammo, so we actually need to rush in there and pick up that guy's scat packs. I'm gonna pick up this scat pack over here. I actually didn't even see that scat pack over there. I'm hearing silent shots or something, which is not a very good thing to be hearing. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, my goodness, I'm scared. Oh, my goodness, that was really close, guys. We literally almost choked that. All right, we're not 25. We get that guy? Yeah, we can. All right, nice. I'm gonna jump up here. Okay, this is not good, boys. Not good. We need ammo fast. I'm gonna let my teammates try to get some of those guys. Oh, boy. No, he's to our side. He's to our side. All right, get down. Let's pick these up. Calling this UAV. Oh, my God. This is so stressful. All right, I'm running away. 100%. I'm, I'm booking my way out of there, boys. That is just not a good story right there. No, if I die to that guy, I'm going to scream, dude. I'm going to literally scream. Nice, able to get him. Nice, and there's this guy to the side here who's running low profile. Who I'm not going to let him make me his next victim. Nice. Is this, is this it? Oh, we got the DNA bomb. We did it. Oh, my God. It took so long. It took so long for me to get this DNA bomb, boys. But we finally got it. I'm calling it in. Fudge you, enemies. Fudge you. We finally did it. Let's go, boys. Woo! We got the AK-12 royalty DNA bomb. I am so happy that we finally got that, guys. Oh, my lordy. I hate using that weapon so badly. This weapon is just terrible, man. It's just so bad. DNA, boys. We did it. 37-0 with the AK-12 royalty. Why does this weapon even exist? Why is it a royalty? I'm not even sure. Anyways, guys, hopefully you all did enjoy this commentary, this live com with the AK-12 royalty DNA bomb. If you guys did, really would appreciate it if you guys would smack that like button. It really does help my channel grow. If you guys are interested in checking out any more of my videos, be sure to stick to the end of this video. I'll be showing you guys two uh, quick little clips of other YouTube videos that you guys can check out at the very end uh, to continue watching more of my content. And if you can't click the annotations on screen, if you're on mobile, be sure to click the links in the description below. I link all the videos that I link at the end of my videos in the description as well. Be sure to also check out all my social media links in the description below, guys. And until next time, everyone, keep gaming. And as always, stay cool. Adios.